Good morning, guys. It's quarantine day what? 60 something? Let's rock and roll. It's 8 15 in the morning. And if I'm gonna be quite honest right now, I didn't know if I was gonna film this video today because I didn't know how tired I'd be if I'd wake up. So I had an 8 a.m. class on Zoom, but it was my last class because I have finals next week. And my professor, like, we caught up with everything, so we just had, like, questions and stuff. And nobody ever asked questions, so we were just all talking, like, you know, wishing well, stuff like that. So it's 8.15, and my next class doesn't start till 9.25, so I thought that I would sleep in till the 9.25 class, because that one I actually have to, like, take notes on today. We're gonna scroll through social media a little, because, you know, I always do that. You guys should definitely follow my social media networks, Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter. I've been obsessed with TikTok, and I'm really new to it, so you guys should follow me. It's Alexandra underscore MBFG. My Instagram is the same, and then my Twitter is Alexandra7XO. I'm so sad. I thought I was going to be able to enjoy some coffee with my cream cheese, but now I'm going to have to go to Dunkin'. But got my Trader Joe's waffles with some cream cheese. When I normally eat my breakfast and drink coffee, I scroll through my emails, um, check out any YouTube notifications, stuff like that. But I'm, wow, I'm really sad. I hope that my mom can fix the Keurig. Did my bed. It's so beautiful out, but it's cold. It's actually so cold. I did the crest whitening strips yesterday because I drink a lot of coffee. My teeth get yellow really, really quickly. I want to get them professionally whitened, but with all that's going on right now in New York here, especially me being in the literal biggest hotspot, I don't think it's a good idea to do that right now. Not essential, not important, but um, yeah, and now I have sensitive teeth, so when I wash them, they just hurt like the tips of them. That hurts. Anyway. Um, I got the Kate Somerville Exfoliate Cleanser, which is a daily foaming cleansing wash. And I got a little mini to try out. I did so much shopping. I bought so much stuff from Ulta, Sephora. They were having so many sales, like the spring sale, like VIB sale, like not good. But this is so good. I've seen such a difference in my skin. Right now my skin's pretty bad just because it was um, that time of the month. But I wanted to point this out to you guys because it's actually really awesome and you could get this for $19 this size and it's been two weeks, three weeks and I've been using it every day. It's 8.50 and Zara Plants at 9.20 and I really want Duncan. I've dunked a couple, Duncan a couple blocks away so I do the pickup delivery and then I get it from the back. I've only gotten Duncan three twice actually. This will be the third time throughout this whole quarantine. Um, but they are really safe there. They... Are very thin and stuff and like if I pick it up or it gloves and as Clorox the cup it's fine so I'm just gonna put on some of my skincare first my eye gel then my touch of moisturizer my skin's been pretty dry lately I don't know why but that was a bug And of course, some lip balm. I don't know what I'm gonna wear because it's cold. I don't know. I'm doing such an honest, like, quarantine get ready morning routine because this is literally what I do almost every single day. Except when I don't have class, I don't wake up this early. Um, or if I sleep over my boyfriend, it's obviously a little different, but got sweatpants. So for now, I'm just gonna put on some black sweatpants and this long sleeve sweater I just packed up all my like sweaters long sleeve literally everything to bring to my grandma's because I don't have space here problems of living in New York so I go back and forth and I just kind of so I don't have a bunch of clutter everywhere and like other closets obviously it's me my mom my brother she lives five minutes away she has so much space so I always leave like my bathing suits and shorts there and then <clears throat> I bring my you know winter stuff like my uh, sweaters and long sleeve over there if I ever need something she's five minutes away so it's not a problem but I don't feel like getting that out and I'm gonna go bring that to her today so I'm gonna put this on for now and I always wear black sweatpants when I start my day because whether I'm doing my makeup or just chilling and doing homework I'm gonna be comfortable number one number two I could always change into any top if I'm gonna be filming or something you know all right I'm dressed my mom's back with the dog so I'm just gonna take me I just gotta fix this hairdo that I got going on over here 
gonna leave my hair like this i legit just put on slow lights with fluffy socks and a jacket because it's cold I'm gonna get my mask a phone and yeah we're gonna be going i'm not i'm not wasting gloves anymore oh this is such a good song I'm not wasting gloves to go to like places like Dunkin' because we don't have a lot, but look, literally what it takes to go to Dunkin', hand sanitizer, Clorox wipes, a mask, like, what has this world come to? Did you think last year you would be going into Dunkin' Donuts with a mask? Because I didn't. Who's so cute? Who's so cute? You thought we lied to you? Got our Dunkin'? Hmm. Nope. Got my Dunkin'. So good. Now I'm gonna log into my computer. I have class in 10 minutes. So this class I actually gotta pay attention and, and take notes. So we're gonna log on into my Gmail. So yeah, I'm gonna get my books ready. And go to class. Do you guys hear those dogs? I feel so bad and genuinely like I feel like I'm gonna call on them But then again what they're gonna be in a shelter like it's so sad. There's dogs. I'm balancing this on a water bottle There's dogs that like when you live who live on the other block, but when you're on my backyard in my backyard, then you see them, but It's like I'm really sad because they always bark and like me and my brother always gives them treats and stuff and like the owners so mean to them like I mean, now the owner, but like, he's so mean to them. Like, not personally, like, on a good terms where we're like, yo, get your dog. But I always want to say something, but then again, like, what? What am I going to say? He's not going to listen. I feel like it's going to make things worse for them. So, it's not going to say shit. Alrighty, so I just finished my class and I put my laptop and like shut my other computer down. But I did write more things on my to do list. So, I think I'm just going to, um, finish what I have to do now. I was gonna go work out and then come back, but I think that's stupid. So I'm gonna probably work on stuff for another hour and a half. Um, I have a quiz to take, which I'm gonna do for my managerial finance class, which actually was a class that I was so nervous about, but I'm doing the best in. I don't know, I used to be really good at math in high school, and then I took pre-calc and calc, and I hated it, but I like managerial finance. Like, it's, I find it quite easy. Like, I understand it, that's what I'm trying to say. Um, I have to do some work for my work and um, I have to work on a project which I'm not going to do right now and I want to do one more section in um, an online class I have. Well, everything's online now, but like an online class I originally had. So I'm going to do those things later. Right now I'm just going to take my quiz and work on replying to emails and um, doing the work that I have to do. Oh, so my coffee, look at that hair. Ew. Alrighty, so I just put on my sweet sweat belt and then I got the like little packet of sweet sweat. I'm gonna go ahead and put on a sweater because I'm freezing. I'm probably gonna sweat so much though, which is good because your girl gained a lot of weights from birth control. Like a lot. <laughs> like, I'm gonna film a whole. Like, I'm going to film a whole video on it. So, I'm going to put the sweet sweat on. It makes me sweat like crazy. And I told myself that I'm going to work out every single day. Literally, like, two days ago. Because it's ridiculous that I snack so much during this quarantine. Which, that made me gain weight. And before that, I gained so much weight. I'm going to put my hair in a ponytail now. Because I'm going to, what's it called? I don't want it to keep falling down. If I do a bun, so I'm gonna do that, put on some sneakers. I'm gonna go for a little run, and then I'm gonna come back and do a workout, some stretches, all that fun stuff. I don't know what possessed me to run that almost mile that I ran, but I feel like I'm gonna die. Yeah, that's never again i'm so out of shape i ran right under a mile and better die 
and it's so sad because in high school I used to be a track star and I was so good I used to be actually really good to the point where I got scouted to run in college and here I am three years later not able to run a mile I used to be able to run like 10 oh my god I feel like I'm about to die after I got my breath, I did some ab workouts and then I went ahead and took a lovely hot shower. I was gonna like film a clip in the shower and be all like cute, but I take such hot showers literally at like 100 degrees that the camera just kept fogging up and made no sense. But I wanted to talk about this body scrub. Well, it's a coconut oil body polish. I got it on the Sephora VIB sale because I really wanted a good scrub that also hydrated my skin and didn't like dry it out or anything like that and I heard amazing reviews about this and I was like you know what let me give this a go this is so good I literally have it for a week and I've been obsessed with it I use it like every other day every three days that I shower um to really exfoliate my body it also makes it so hydrated that like I don't even have to put on lotion after which is like insane but I wanted to talk about this because it is so good okay guys so it's 12 40 I just took a shower <laughs> did a lot of things i feel like i've gotten a lot of things done already but if i do my makeup during quarantine which i do maybe two or three times a week it depends what i'm doing if i'm going to be filming something or some kind of content then i will do my makeup but usually i don't wear makeup i kind of just do a face mask and sit but today i do want to be a little bit productive i might film a video or some tiktoks whatever i love filming tiktoks i film like all the time literally obsessed with tiktok which you guys should follow me on but i just got myself some fruit and one thing during this quarantine that i really have been enjoying so much is watching netflix um when i had school and work and all this other stuff i never watched netflix literally barely like it was really rare that i would watch netflix so i started a couple of tv shows right now i'm into money heist i'm on part four episode four um, so season four, episode four, it is so good. Definitely recommend you guys. Very, very good. So this is the time where I just sit, just take my time to do my makeup as well. I always rush when I do my makeup. So it's nice to sit down, chill, do my makeup and watch some Netflix. So that's what I'm going to do. If you guys want to see this makeup look, definitely let me know. It is just my everyday makeup routine, but I did switch out and started to use a lot of new products. So definitely leave me a comment down below if you guys would want to see. Alrighty, so I just finished my makeup. I did my hair. I just put it up in like a little low bun because I don't know what to do with it. And I don't want to put a heat on it. I think that's absolutely ridiculous. I put these purplish sweatpants on with the matching top it's from misguided from carly bibles collection it's a little bit old so i don't think you could get a big probably find something very similar on misguided and yeah it's really nice out now i don't know um what time is it i watched oh, like an episode and a half it's 1 38 i think i'm gonna film some tiktoks because why not i don't want to start filming a video just because i'm gonna go to my grandma soon so I know I won't have enough time and I hate like being rushed when I'm doing those things. So I'm going to go ahead and film a TikTok. I might go outside. I'm just like, I don't want to go outside because I, I don't like when people watch me film TikToks. Like vlogging, I don't care. But TikToks, it's like weird. So all my neighbors just said it's come out and enjoy the nice bubble. So I just looked at the TikToks I filmed and I decided to post one, so. It's my new favorite dance. You guys should definitely follow me on my TikTok. It's the same as most of my handles. Alexandra underscore MBFG. Just downloaded it recently. Been obsessed with it. Got a few rolling here. Literally what I do most of my days in quarantine. I think TikTok's great, so. Follow me for some fun content on there. I'm going to my grandma's right now to do what I gotta do and I'm also gonna drop off some clothes at my cousin's house. So, yeah, there's no good music on the radio and I didn't connect my phone to Bluetooth, so. So I just got back, got all my shorts and all my bathing suits. Gonna organize them now. Alrighty, so, oh, I got a little cold from a little part again. I'm gonna just kind of go through these bathing suits. So I already have some because I 
I ordered more for this year thinking I was going to Mexico, but I'm not because of coronavirus. I was supposed to go a while ago. I was supposed to go over a month ago, actually. I was supposed to go over a month ago, so I just got my old bathing suits. Gonna go through them. Probably keep most of them because last year when I was packing them, I kind of got rid of all the ones I didn't want to wear anymore, so just kind of gonna go through them. And yes, this I was using for a video and I still didn't get to go put it downstairs. So, oh my god, this one, I used to love this one. Yeah, literally not gonna fit me. 57. I have 57 bathing suits, you guys. That is insanity to me. Here I have like all my tops. So I laid out some of them and then other ones are just uh, piled and piled and piled and then here I have all my bottoms which just goes on and on and on and then here I have my one pieces because just didn't know how to really store them so I just made the green juice that's so good I literally just put ice water and then that green mix. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to go ahead and log in and do some work. Honestly, I have quite a lot to do. I'm probably going to just sit for like two, three hours, do homework and stuff, and then go see my boyfriend. And that's about it for today. I did quite a lot of stuff. I got everything done that I needed to get done. It's only 440 right now. So I'm going to grab my computer, going to do my reading assignments that I have to do. What else do I have to do? Um, and a project for one of my classes and then hopefully my boyfriend will be back from work I'm also gonna put this away after this stuff dries um, But yeah, I really really hope you guys enjoyed this morning routine um, It wasn't really a morning routine, but it wasn't a full day in my life. So I don't know what I'm gonna call it Maybe a quarantine day in my life. I don't know because I just think the rest of the day is gonna be pretty much just work, 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 and then go into my boyfriend later tonight and watch a movie. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed. Yet again, if you guys are new to my channel, subscribe, give this video a big thumbs up, and I really hope you guys are staying safe and healthy throughout this time. I'm praying for each and every one of you guys. I hope your family is doing well, and so are you. I know this is a rough time, but we have to stay positive, do things we enjoy. I actually might paint tonight. That's what I might do, too, after I do some work. Depends what time my boyfriend gets home. We'll see, we'll see. But yeah, I really love you guys all so, so, so much. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.